Now at 6, police opening fire on a murder suspect just steps from a Miami-Dade jail. That suspect killed at the scene and still a lot of questions tonight about what led to this shooting and if it could have been prevented. CBS 4's Aralia Ortega live in West Miami-Dade with the story. Aralia. Rick, the Florida Department of Law Enforcement is out here investigating this police-involved shooting that happened right behind the jail on the north side. This caused a lot of commotion in the area with people who work nearby thinking there was an escaped inmate, and it even led to a lockdown at the jail. Crime scene tape up everywhere as Chopper 4 is over the scene outside Turner Guilford Knight Correctional Center in West Miami-Dade. We thought it was an escape. So we were like, let's lock our doors and make sure that you know everybody's safe and everything. And but the commotion had nothing to do with the jail. Miami-Dade police say a police-involved shooting took place shortly before two o'clock in the afternoon. Our robbery intervention detail. They were looking for a subject that was wanted for murder on a city of Miami case. According to Miami-Dade police, two detectives from the robbery intervention detail spotted a murder suspect they were looking for in a gold SUV in the area of Northwest 41st Street and 70th Avenue on the north side of the jail. When they attempted to approach the vehicle, shots were fired and the individual was struck. Fire rescue responded. He was pronounced deceased on the scene. A number of bullet casings are seen on the ground as a yellow tarp covers the body of a 37-year-old man, according to police. People who work nearby were startled by the scene. But I just seen the whole commotion. I seen all the helicopters. I knew something serious had happened once I saw the helicopters and all the police presence. The shooting leading to a lockdown at the jail. It is on lockdown at this point. There is, and that includes visitation. They are not allowing any visitation at this time um, and until further notice, until we reevaluate a little further down when it will come back to normal function. And back out here live, Miami-Dade Corrections told us just a little while ago that the lockdown has been lifted and visitations will resume at 8 o'clock. Police have not yet released the name of the man who was shot and we are working to gather more information on the murder he was accused of committing from City of Miami Police. For now, live in West Miami-Dade, Aurelia Ortega, CBS 4 News. Aurelia, thank you. The